Christian <laughs> brother is my uh, sword. Get yeah, right. We're gonna go back into the other article, right? And once again, we have another person put emphasis on all humans share large amounts of DNA, which means individual ancestry tests can't rely, can't reliably trace your genetics very far without other evidence, right? Genetic genealogy tracking has become big business now we have another company another another um another website or scientific website or someone who who deals with science or biology right we hear another one of them pointing that out before they even get into whether or not this shit is real or fake they already telling you that what what they're what 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 the genetic companies are basically advertising it for right they're trying to get some money they're trying to get some money my dude and that's what happening we already see that this shit is pseudoscience we already we already got too many articles we already heard too many other scientists we already heard the works when it comes to dna so you can't you should never let nobody present dna to you as if it's absolute it can't trace you to no ancestry land. So if it can't trace you to no ancestry land and your ass been here for 400 fucking years, there's no way that they can test you, trace you to Niger, um, Cameroon, God, no. What? He's a liar. You disgust me. How can you live with yourself? You sit on a throne of lies. Talk about me. What's up, man? What you want to talk about? Listen, my man. Let me. All right. So look, look. Let's let's make some sense out of this, right? So through a three-hour presentation, right? Everything that I presented was fake. You could debunk everything I presented. I could debunk the way you tried to present it. You took a lot of shit out of okay. context. You cherry picked a lot okay. of shit. And your your final conclusion. What so, you trying, and I cross what reference. Trying, do I on, not show on, more? Hold on, hold on, hold on. What you trying to present to the people? Your conclusion is totally off. Well, go ahead. All right. So I'm just want. I just want to ask one question. I'm gonna ask one question to everybody on the panel. Everybody on the panel. I'm gonna ask one question. Is DNA absolute? Hell so no. Look, 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 look. Yes. Use, like, I'm look, asking everybody on the panel, and I'm being no, look, look. I'm being sincere about it. Is DNA absolute? Yes, no. Is it absolute? Yes, no. Is it absolute? Yes. Now look. Now look. So hold on. So did oh oh oh. So you niggas are saying, oh wait, wait. I want to be clear. I'm trying to process this information. I do like y'all niggas do. I'm trying to process it. No, you ask the question. I'm going to answer your question. Watch this. I'm asking you a question, brother. Is DNA absolute? Yes, no. You can answer. You you showing one of five different. Brother, look, all look, scientists. Look, 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 brother. Let me show you what your problem is. Is it to take two seconds? You use this source. It's from 2013. You're trying to use this to discredit DNA, which is bullshit. Because even in your source, it's so in 2013. So in 2013, when niggas was taking read DNA that. tests, read it, read it, is this read information it, read credible? It, read it. Read it. Read no, it. I'm not reading nothing, brother. It's my I, source. I'm not reading. I'm not reading nothing. I'm not reading. Your source, listen, your source says with the advanced testing, you can provide a general ancestry indication, i.e., northeastern, western Africa, or Middle Eastern, and in some cases, even more specific, said David Nichols, director of the DNA Worldwide Group to BBC News. This is your source. Is so DNA say, absolute? No, yes or no? When I say, when I say, when you your conclusions is way mm-hmm. off, just because you read something word for word. That don't mean you're not taking the shit out of context. You you dead wrong, nigga. That's why you got the fuck up out of it. Because you don't want to answer this question. He why left. Yep. So Where did he go? He, he ran. He left. He left. Beca- he left because his story he killed him. And I was getting ready to tell him. I said, "What happened? What? What? Yeah, he ran. Of course, he ran. He left again. Because what happened? He left again. He left again because he don't. He don't want to have to deal with his mm. own source. And on top of that, too, we've also gathered. Science has also gathered far more samples." Since his article, this is ridiculous, bro. <laughs> and the it's whole like, sample yeah, makes it more accurate. That's it.
I don't forensics know. use this too. Look, look this is, I, so I, I don't know. I see it. We hear you. Um, so I don't know where they we do get it from. So this is where ancestry comes. It says with current technology, like we keep trying to tell them, current technology, ancestry DNA has on average an accuracy accuracy rate of over ninety nine percent for each marker tested. How much, like, so when we say, yeah, they're accurate, is it absolute? Is it absolute? Is it absolute? Like, what the fuck does that even mean, man? Like, you want to know if it's 100%? Like, what the fuck? <laughs> it's 99%. Like, what yeah, because it's not 100%. <laughs> but <laughs> that's about as close as 100% as you can get. People that just come up here need to see that. They need to see an African, and they need to see an Indian, and they need to see the, 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 the base so they could choose a side. Not a coincidence is a major factor in this community. People don't even know it. Goofy motherfuckers.